Okay, so here we are. Let's talk about exporting it. Okay, so ours, ours is ready now. Normally, and we're not going to do it in this video, but I would watch it a few times. Okay, I'm just, just you really got to watch it to make sure everything sounds good, everything's acting good. So go ahead and review it, uh, but I'm not going to take the time to do that in here. So uh, let's get, to, we're going to export this. I'm going to go ahead and go back to projects. Okay, and so we can see it's our video there. We're going to uh, just click on it once so it's highlighted. And then we're going to go up here to the share button. Okay, we're going to go to share. And we want to export file. Here we go. Export file. So it takes our name here, Curiosity, Mr. Flick, puts a little description on it, tag, you know, this is normal stuff. Uh, yeah, we're going to do make sure it's video and audio. And then do it at the highest resolution possible. Right now it's saying I can do this at 1080. Uh, your quality should be high and compression should be faster. And everything is set there. It's going to make a pretty big file, 627 megabytes. So, eh. That's got me thinking that's way too big to upload to Google, Google Classroom, so let's take it down a notch, 720. Ooh, okay, this is now 379. That's, that's looking a little better. Still a pretty big file. Let's try it at 540. Okay, that's a more decent sized file to be uploading around the internet, especially turning into me. So, okay. So in this case, you're not gonna go with high resolution. You're gonna go take it down to 540 so that we get a good file size here, because we're talking four minutes and seven seconds. I'm gonna hit next. And it's going to say, well, hey, where do you want to put this? I always put things in my downloads folder. You probably put things on your desktop. But go ahead and pick wherever you like to put things. And then I'm going to hit save. Okay, it's not done. That's the thing I want to show you. It's actually working right now. And this little circle becomes a little pie chart. And it's going to show you how it's working. So there's no file made yet. And you kind of think, oh, well, let me just quit out of iMovie. No, 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 no. No, you got to watch this whole little pie thing close. Now, you could go work on other projects, and it'll still keep exporting it in the background. You can probably go, you know, surf the internet on uh, Chrome or something. But it better just, let's just wait this out and get it to export, and then it's going to be in the downloads folder. And then once it's in your downloads folder, then you can, you know, upload it to Google Classroom. You can turn it in to me. You can do all sorts of things because you now have it. Uh, on your desktop or in your downloads, wherever you happen to have exported it to. But the big secret here is wait for the export to finish and then a little, a little window will pop up and say, hey, we're done exporting. So, so there you have it. There's uh, video editing. I can't wait to see your final project of this tutorial uh, to see that your uh, work matches my work and that you can maybe move on to level two where we're going to do some really cool stuff talking about J cuts and L cuts and match cuts and picture in picture and dissolving and adding all sorts of cool sound effects that's coming up in level two hope that you return for that and uh, we'll see you later